There is one caveat when working with MIDI. MIDI data is positioned in the timeline relative to what are known as MIDI ticks, rather than absolute samples or seconds. Ticks themselves are in relation to tempo. So if we modify the tempo map inside Pro Tools, you'll see that the note positions get all out of whack. To solve this problem, DTM needs to learn the tempo map of your session. This is pretty easy. From the File menu, select Export, MIDI. It's important to understand that this menu option is unavailable and will be grayed out until there is at least one MIDI track in the session. Leave the default export settings and click OK. Save the MIDI file anywhere on your machine, but somewhere easy to navigate to. Now click the Import button on DTM. A file dialog will appear. Find and select the MIDI file you just saved and click Choose. DTM now understands how to speak the tick language of your session. If we drag in the MIDI notes now, they will again be properly aligned. Unfortunately, if you modify your session's tempo map, you will need to re-import it back into DTM. On the plus side, DTM does permanently remember the tempo information. So if you close the plugin and come back later, you'll see the lights still green, indicating the plugin remembers the previously imported tempo map.